A lot of changes students in the tri-state will notice this year as they head back to school, especially true when this comes to sports. As part of our ongoing back to school coverage, WCPO 9 News reporter Madeline Audley joins us live outside Wyoming High School. We have a lot of great athletes at Wyoming and they are excited about this new year, Madeline. Yeah, Julie, good morning. When you watch these students practice on the sports field here at Wyoming High School, things feel a lot like they used to. It's almost hard to remember that just a few months ago, many of the students here didn't even know if they'd be able to play this year at all. It's just such a different atmosphere when it's like this instead of last year. And just coming back from that and knowing everything that we missed and that we get back this year, it's just really exciting. Varsity volleyball player Kathleen Hinkle says she feels comfortable on the court because she's vaccinated. This year protocols are a lot different. Players are not required to wear masks or social distance. Spectators and coaches inside are asked to wear them, but outdoors they don't have to. Adam Jones, who coaches the boys soccer team, says having sports back is bringing not only excitement, but relief. What I always tell our kids is don't have a short memory. Like remember how grateful you were to just get out with your teammates last year when we had lost it. Uh, and so continue to be grateful for the moments that we have together. The fall sports season is already well underway, but as COVID-19 continues, the athletic director here tells us these safety protocols can always change. Reporting live at Wyoming High School, Madeline Ottilie, WCPO 9 News.